<laughs> All right, guys, welcome back. It is time for entertainment news. First one is a sad story. Um, Kayode Odumosu, a.k.a. Pakasumu, passes on. Nollywood actor Kayode Odumosu, a.k.a. Pakasumu, has died. Now, the announcement of his death was put out by Nollywood actress Foluke Daramola Salako via Instagram page, where she stated that um, he died after a brief illness. Now, she wrote... Breaking news, our model veteran actor Pakasumu Kayode Odumosu finally takes a bow. It is with so much heavy pain in our hearts that we announce, well, that we regret to announce you, you are in para. That's our Para Africa Foundation model actor Pakasumu has given up the ghost after a brief illness. The news was broken by a close source that stays around the hospital where he gave up the ghost. We will keep you updated with further information on this. And I mean, I saw this last night and I was just so sad because I still saw a movie. And there's just the way he's always with, especially with the. Um, His glasses. That, no, there's this thing he's always. Uh, yeah, the yeah, pipe. yeah, that pipe. That like, is, yeah. Oh, that too much strong. And like, I was still laughing and I just go on Instagram and I'm like, wow, wow, this is just sad. And um, I can just. The only thing I can say is may he so rest in peace. Yeah, like, it's so that. sad that um, Pakasimo did not make it after all. You know, yeah. it was very ill and it's been ill for a very long mm -hmm. time. And mm -hmm. I know that Folika Daramala has a foundation and, uh, you know, it showcased, it made us see what was really happening the because thing, yeah. it was actually being carried into that event center uh, when they had the grand event, you know, mm -hmm. uh, by two people. And, um, you know, it goes back to what I always say. You know how you have worked hard. Not even Pakasumu. Pakasumu could speak English well. Mm -hmm. He could speak Yoruba well. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, ah, how can somebody who's this brilliant not get proper health care, proper attention yeah. when uh, it takes ill or when people take ill like that? And, you know, it's just so sad. And I'm just saying that, well, you know, how we learn from other people's experiences, like, this kid, it can be anybody. You know how you have worked out all your life and then you need help and, uh, well, maybe stuff are not just you know right. coming forth it's just so sad i don't know what to say but then i would say that uh, may so rest in perfect peace Amen. definitely may Amen. so rest in perfect peace yes moving on to the next story solid stuff versus achievers music another month another artist versus record label drama this time is between singer solid star and his re former record label achievers music it all started when Solista called out his former label boss, OC Achievers, on Instagram, accusing him of always wanting to see him sad. In a now deleted post, he wrote, and I'm quoting, I've been nothing but good to you and your family from day one, but you want to see me sad. The table will turn at the end at OC Achievers. Responding to that particular post, Chiori Paul Cole, aka OC Achievers, also took to his Instagram page to issue his own statements. Mm. He wrote, Mr. Joshua Iniyezo, Solistar, I know you missed me so much. My Midas touch on your career, I discovered you in 2007 and you lived with me for two years without a contract. Your welfare was my responsibility. In 2009, you signed your first pro contract. In 2014, you signed another contract that expired in 2017. We parted ways peacefully. Now let's figure out who is owing the other one. I invested over 100 million in 10 years and your whole bookings for 10 years didn't generate 10% of the invested amount. Two, the car you got from Achievers on higher purchase for 15 million, we deducted a little above 2 million and I learned you've sold the car without completing payment. It's a criminal offense and we can decide to take actions. You're like a house I built and I won't want to bring it down, but threats to my life, I wouldn't take it lightly. Any more Pim, I go change him. Please, if you love him and you are close to him, watch him closely. I think he's suffering seriously, serious depression and amnesia of the brain. Salista then commented on the post writing, Oh, see, I simply requested for my royalties from 2008 till 2018, and you're using it as an avenue to seek for fake sympathy. Give me a sec. Hmm. Drama loading, oh people. <laughs> Drama. It's all off me. <laughs> okay, this this is not going to stop anytime soon. Um, yeah. Probably because it's likes of Solista where in that era where people don't, because we've seen a whole lot of drama lately. I don't think if the problem I will have with Nigerian artists is if a new artist will still go through this drama after seeing all the trends of Nigerian artists and record label drama. drama. Because I'm sure for Achievers music. To want to take whatever decision they took 
and they parted ways amicably. Again, we ask Lord Solista, we are good, we are good. Why all of a sudden, he has dropped a new single, he has dropped a new song, and he's saying this, and he put all of this up, and he deleted his post. Are you pushing your new single, or what's happening? Just wanted attention, because, I mean, if you're going to put out stuff like that, what do you mean by, um, you always want to see me um, fail sad. or something, or sad? I, it's not, I think it's, it's not, I'm trying not to use the wrong word, but I don't think it is a smart move. I mean, there is nothing to back this thing that you're saying. It's just like me saying, oh, OJ, I can see that. You can see what? We're, we are dealing with facts here. We're not children. Okay. And, and, and I like the fact that OC responded with, like, facts, one, fact, two. one, two, like, three. Okay, so this one we can take actions, but we've just decided to let it slide. Because we want, I, I think there are some people that don't just live for peace, because I feel like this is very unnecessary. Like, Solistar wanted attention, and maybe you wanted attention for your new music. Okay, so... I don't know Solista to be that uh, troublesome ah, person. You did see his post about J1 last two weeks. <laughs> but see, I think, <laughs> so I like OC. I like the way, I mean, I like he the responded. way he responded. And I like the fact, as you said. But one thing is, he said something. He said maybe he's suffering from depression. depression or amnesia. I won't say amnesia, maybe depression. Some people can be paranoid. Maybe you're just going through some stuff and then you're taking it out on people. We can always give people benefit of doubt. So I, I won't still like cancel Solistar in my mind. So, so I think that it's just done the right thing by saying this. So perhaps he has that opportunity of looking inwards so and seeing it's that. Asking, it's asking for royalties. Uh, uh, maybe it would, it would have a rethink at the end of today. See, because for what OC is saying, you say you're able to owe us. Yes. And aside that, if, if you're saying that um, um, you're depressed and everything, and that's why you want to be throwing tantrums, huh? like it doesn't make sense to me if you're depressed. Take care of that's yourself. What is Speak that's up what to somebody. Is like talk to someone you trust because it might not be as easy. It as might that. not be as easy as that. But then I don't think that looking for more trouble is going to give you peace of mind as well. Because before you get to the point where you are dealing with depression, you are dealing with loads of anxiety. So if you are going to go and be pumping that's this thing where the, that, that, that doesn't that's exist, what, that's, what that's OC, another problem for that's you. That's what Osi is saying. Osi is not saying he's depressed. So Osi is the one just yeah, it's insinuating that, is that. it's like it's like you're yes, going through yes. and you need my touch in your career. And then I like the fact that said it, you're just like a house i built and I'm i will not to destroy bring you up. so you see sure. now, i think on this note solista should just drop it because he has said if you threaten his life court. he will do court. more stuff and that's when it will become a drama go to court. So i think solista should just stay you should go to court, it should go to court. <laughs> all right guys finally moving on to the foreign scene hmm Aproko, we are here <laughs> is kylie jenner back with travis scott <laughs> hmm. Well, it seems reality star and beauty entrepreneur Kylie Jenner is back with her baby daddy, Travis Scott. Now, we're not so sure, but over the weekend, Kylie posted on her Insta story three loved up throwback photos of her and Travis Scott at a basketball playoff game in 2017 with the caption, it's a mood. Hmm. Just so you know, back in October 2019, it was reported that Kylie and Travis Scott, who shared daughter Stormy Webster, announced that they were taking space apart barely two years after they began their relationship. But hmm. now, we don't know what's going on. <laughs> what is wrong you, with this, you, people? I mean, that's your, that's your rumor there for today. Abby. It's a mood. So, what's going on? And she just Maybe she's missing Travis and she's just like, let me... Let me three, post, yeah. three, oh, three. And, and as I, as I was posting those pictures, she even supported. Um, he had like an endorsement um, thing with a brand mm -hmm. that she even supported by rocking that brand. So I think every, everybody's just being civil and not until decay in the situation. Oh so, my God. Um, so maybe they are wow. not back together, but the fact whereby they are still civil about the relationship, there's a child involved. I, I let's just keep. And there are some first. times, maybe I don't know, maybe there are reasons people cannot just get married, but they still like we'll just you know each other and all that, and they're always just like OJ, go B. each other's back. We'll just D. I, I don't like them together though. I actually do. Over Tiger. Tiger or Travis Scott for Kylie? No, Tiger. But I did, that Tiger time, I even felt like it was jazz. Ah. Yes. I'm done. The African syndrome. <laughs> yeah. They have come. Oh, you're a bad girl. So Travis, Travis is like an upgrade? Uh, well, I think so, yes. From Tiger, yes. Absolutely. I think so. So after Travis, Drake? I don't know. Okay, <laughs> yes. Ladies and gentlemen, we're done with the entertainment news. <laughs>